Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Mass Effect with me at Nidhi. Um, last time we landed on this planet, but before we continue, let's see about the squad, since we have a couple points to spend. So, Jacob, he can pull incendiary ammo, Cerberus operative, uh, so that's the yeah general upgrade, and barrier. Squad member is not loyal. You're not loyal? Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> Anyways, that means we are left with um, one or two ranks in Cerberus Operative and in Pull. Also, since I'm not sure how long I'll use him, uh, that should be just okay. Did it accept? Yep. And with Miranda, she can overload. Massive energy blasts, overpower shields and synthetic enemies. She can warp, rips enemies apart at the molecular level and stops health regeneration. Effective against armor and biotic barriers and Cerberus officer, which is the general thing again. Yeah, she gets a bit less health, but she gets squad health. Oh, cool. Cool, cool, cool. And squad weapon. Oh. So she can boost the whole squad. Gets a bit less for herself, health. But uh, two and a half for everyone else. So, because we can be a squad of three all the time. Not sure if that applies to her as well. But if it doesn't, it would give 5% to well, overall squad health and to 5%, another 5% to squad weapon damage. Uh, so I'll surely get one or two of these levels, perhaps even three. She has the basic abilities on the others, so let's give her three of them. And Shepard cannot do a thing. Good. That should be okay. Also Codex, that's just stuff to read up on if there's the is when subjected oh it's it's red is the ability of rare individuals ah well we may at one point go there and do that but for now we have the mission freedom's progress look for what happened here we don't have a map and we can't have our weapons changed or something Okay, so first rule of RPGs, check the environment for any loot you could find. There's nothing around. Also we're switching to an indoor area, so let's switch over to a more rapid firing. Okay. Anything to loot? No. Anything out here? No. Big open area. That could be a problem. Strange. No bodies, no structural damage, and no signs of battle. Display current direction of objective. Ah, just the the um, the sensor on the bottom. Wish that would be also available. Oh, what what did they do here? That looks like some serious bombs. And they're just lying here in the open. <laughs> Okay, we have to get to the door, probably. But just in case, uh, get a couple credits. We can't enter here, right? Yep. Oh well.
Okay, there's some bots. Strange. Let's see what the sniper rifle can do. Yeah, it works. Oh, come on, that was a hit. <laughs> And there's a dog-like thing, alright. Ow. Those mechs shouldn't have been hostile. They should have recognized us as human. Someone reprogrammed. Yeah, as I said. We have a couple uh mechs automated defenses going after us. Right, so I used way more shots than I recover, which is also good. There's a couple things to pick up, medigel and a bypass. Let's see if I can do that. So we have that thing. That matches up. We have the C symbol that matches up. The ground symbol and those two match up and those two match up. Two thousand bucks, not bad. They've right. They? Oh, come on. <laughs> One down. Uh, how can I melee? Yep, okay, F is melee. Now we're going into buildings again. Should probably switch to a different weapon. Also, is that open or is that... No, that's a glass front. Yep. Alright. Uh, salvage, don't forget that. Thousand bucks. Ooh, survivors. You said you'd let me handle this. Wait, Shepard? I'm not taking any chances with Cerberus operatives. Put those weapons down! Shepard? Is that... you're alive? Uh, yeah, it's me. And I can tell you something about our past. Remember when I gave you that get data tally? Did it help you complete your pilgrimage? Yes, it did. Fraza, weapons down. This is definitely Commander Shepard. Why is your old commander working for Cerberus? I don't know. Maybe we should ask. I am not working for them, I'm working with them. Cerberus rebuilt me, but I'm not taking their orders. We can discuss the specifics once I know why you're here. One of our people was here on pilgrimage. His name was Vitor. We came to find him. And have you found him? If Vitor survived the attack, he may be able to tell us what happened. That's the hope. We've seen him, but he might not be in the best state to answer questions. He was injured and uh, nervous around. She means that he was unstable. Combine that with damage to his Sutsio 2 scrubbers and an infection from an open air exposure, and he's likely delirious. When he saw us landing, he hid in a warehouse on the far side of town. We suspect he also programmed the mechs to attack anything that moved. So, he's responsible for that. Uh, can we work together? Vitor's the only one who can tell us what happened here. We should work together to find him. Good idea. You'll need two teams to get past the drones anyway. Now we're working with Cerberus? No, Praza. You're working for me. If you can't follow orders, go wait on the ship. Head for the warehouse through the center of the colony. We'll circle around the far side and draw off some of the drones to clear you a path. Uh, yeah, let's just get some background here. Your people really don't like Cerberus. What did I miss? They killed our people, infiltrated our flotilla, and tried to blow up one of our ships. That's, That's not, not how nice. I explained it exactly. It was nothing personal. We can argue over who killed who later. Right now, we've got a job to do. Agreed. 
We work together to get to Vitor. Yep. Make sure to keep in radio contact. Will do. Good luck, Shepard. Whatever happens, it's good to have you back. Oh, also, I switched uh, the mic noise gate around in between episodes because uh, the mic was constantly on, probably because of some noise. So, hopefully my voice is not hacked Thank off you. sometimes. One of security drones up ahead. Oh. Thanks for the warning. We'll take care of them. Can we shoot them? Will they come? Find us? No. Alright. So, let's loot. So, the reload on this rifle is really fast. <laughs> Just kick it and it will reload. So, another bypass thing. Um, those will match. Um, those will match. Those two will match, and those two, and those two. Okay, 2,000 bucks, not bad, not bad. Now, let's see what we'll find out here. Use overload on ah, some drones, where are they? Whoa, towers! Ow. <laughs> ow! Ow, ow, ow! Nice. Did not see these towers. There we go. Alright. Wow. Uh, the door closed go. on me. Nice. Good. Uh, We should have expected this. Come on, we can still catch them. All right, so if we're full on uh, Medi chills, we will get 100 cash from from these. All right. Any? Any? Anything? Oh, come on. No! Ah, what the? <laughs> Don't do that. Okay, so I can use that. And did that relocate? Ah, so these drones can turn into turrets. I see. They did want to get to Vito first. Get your squad into cover and I'll open the loading bay doors. We'll take cover by the doors. All sure right. You take point. But first, I'll need to gather all these things. Another take point, pack. Shepard. We'll cover the door. All right. Uh, so I can use Q and right. E to get. Understood. Waypoints on we'll take cover by the door, friends, uh, allies, squad mates. Oh, I have to, I have to be up there. Well, then I'll rather take heavy or something. Okay, that's a big mech. Big Mac? What? <laughs> Ouch. Ouch. What colony is that with this amount of uh, weaponry? That Mac's got heavy armor plating. Those quarians never stood a chance. This is gonna be one tough son of a bitch to take down. Overload will take out their shield. 
All right, that's that for the um Why do I have to? Can't you do that yourself? Ow. Uh, wait, what? Someone is down? Just shoot the armor. Uh, incendiary ammo is better against armor, I think, right? Uh, damages health, rips, rips through armor, yeah. So I need to just rush away. <laughs> Can I get into cover somewhere? Well, okay, he's down. Going up. Okay, um, wh wh where were we and where are we now? Ah, there's the Quarians, so we don't want to get there yet. <laughs> Probably want to loot the rest of the place first, like these weapon cells. Ah, there's... Uh, oops. Heavy ammo. That's good. That's good. So, what do we have in here? Let's start the bypass. Is it always just the um, just some cash in here? Let's see, is that one? And then we have these two and these two. Okay. Yeah, so far just cash. Um, well, I mean, probably we can do a lot with cash. That's okay. Ooh, iridium. This is valuable. And heavy weapon ammo research. What? <laughs> well, that sounds cool. Oh damn! That's where I have to go. Expo protect, safe from swarms. Have to hide. No monsters. No swarms. No, 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 no. Vitor? No Vitor. Not here. Swarms can't find. Monsters coming. Have to hide. Uh, we're here to rescue you. Nobody's gonna hurt you anymore. I don't think he can hear you, Commander. Have to hide. Have to hide. Mechs will protect. Swarms coming. Storm coming. Storm of swarms. <laughs> All right, so I can do right or left click during cutscenes sometimes. You're human. Where did you hide? How come they didn't find you? Who didn't find us? The, the monsters, the swarms. They took everyone. Yeah, well, we weren't here. We're not survivors, Vitor. We just got here. You don't know. You didn't see, but I see everything. Looks like uh -huh. security footage. He must have pasted it together manually. What the hell is that? My god. I think it's a collector. Is that some kind of alien? They're a species from somewhere beyond the Omega-4 relay. Only a few people have ever seen one in person. They usually work through intermediaries, like slavers or hired mercenaries. If they're involved with the Reapers somehow, it could explain what happened to the colonies. I see. The collectors have advanced technology. They could have a weapon that disables an entire settlement at once. The Seeker swarms. No one can hide. The Seekers find you, freeze you, then the monsters take you away. And how did you not get caught? Why didn't the collectors take you? Swarms didn't find me. Monsters didn't know I was here. The Collectors aren't known for being careless. Maybe his Enviro suit kept him from showing up on their sensors. 
or they were using technology specifically designed to detect humans. Only human colonies have been hit. Okay, are the Reapers via the collectors trying to collect data about humans because a human has killed one of them? Tell me more about these swarms. It's how they find you. Seeker clouds, machines like tiny insects. They go everywhere, they find you, then they sting you, freeze you. Sounds like miniature probes, maybe. Find victims, then immobilize them with a stasis field or nerve toxin. All right. I want to know more about the collectors. Nobody knows much. They're so rare, a lot of people don't even believe they exist. More importantly, why are they abducting human colonists? What are they after? Maybe the elusive man can figure it out. What happened next? The monsters took the people onto the ship, and then they left. The ship flew away. But they'll be back for me. No one escapes. I think that's probably all we're getting out of him, Commander. We appreciate what you told us. You were very helpful. I studied them. The monsters. The swarms. I recorded them with my Omni tool. Lots of readings. Electromagnetic. Dark energy. We need to get this data to the elusive man. Grab the quarry and call the shuttle to come pick us up. No. What? Vitor is injured. He needs treatment, not an interrogation. We won't hurt him. We just need to see if he knows anything else. He'll be returned unharmed. Your people tried to betray us once already. If we give him to you, we'll never get the intel we need. Praza was an idiot, and he and his men paid for it. You're welcome to take Vitor's Omnitool data, but please, just let me take him. Uh, well, would you like to join the crew again? You don't have to take Vitor and go. We could work together, just like old times. I want to, but I can't. I've got a mission of my own. It's too important for me to abandon, even for you. When it's over, and I'm still alive, we'll see what happens. Can we help? That sounds dangerous. What are you doing? I don't think Cerberus needs to hear about it. But it's in Geth space. That should tell you how important it is. Alright. Well, take him. He's traumatized and he needs medical care. Tally will give us the Omnitool data and take him to the flotilla. Understood, Commander. Thank you, Shepard. I'm glad you're still the one giving the orders. Good luck out there. If I find anything that can help you, I'll let you know. We're ready for pickup. No, I want to loot everything. Doesn't look like I get the chance. Good work on Freedom's progress. The Quarians forwarded their findings from Vidor's debriefing. No new data, but it's a surprising olive branch given our history. You and I have different methods, but I can't argue with your results. You ever think about playing nice once in a while? Diplomacy is great when it works, but difficult when everyone already perceives you as a threat. But more importantly, you confirm the Collectors are behind the abductions. Why do I get the feeling you knew about them already? I had my suspicions, but I needed proof. The Collectors are enigmatic at best. They periodically travel to the Terminus systems, looking to gather seemingly unimportant items or specimens, usually in exchange for their technology. When their transactions are complete, they disappear as quickly as they arrive, back beyond the unmapped Omega-4 relay. Until now, we've had no evidence of direct aggression by the Collectors. Alright, uh... Why is the Omega-4 relay unmapped? What do we know about it? Only that no ship passing through it has ever returned. Our best guess is that the relay reacts differently to Collector vessels, allowing them safe passage. If they can manipulate relays, that's just further evidence of the connection with the Reapers. Any ideas on why they've shifted their focus to humans? If they're agents for the Reapers, it could be any number of reasons. Obviously, humanity played a huge role in Sovereign's Yeah, as I said. That might have been enough to draw their attention. What really concerns me is why they bother abducting the colonists. Once the humans are paralyzed, why not just kill them? For science? Like you did some cruel science experiments, I think? What are the Collectors getting from these deals? The Collectors aren't very forthcoming about their motives. 
Generally, they seek out species with rare genetic mutations or abnormalities. They pay slavers and work groups exorbitant sums to obtain these specimens, and then they leave. But they've never targeted a single species before, and the previous sample sizes were in the dozens, not the tens of thousands. Aha. Uh -huh. Well, you know something that I don't. You're holding something back. How do you know the Reapers are involved? The patterns are there, buried in the data. The Consul and the Alliance want to believe the Reaper threat died with Sovereign. You and I know better. I won't wait until the Reapers are on the march. We need to take the fight to them. Hmm, yes, probably. If this is a war, I'll need an army. Or a really good team. I've already compiled a list of soldiers, scientists, and mercenaries. You'll get dossiers on the best of them. Finding them and convincing them to work with you could be challenging, but you're a natural leader. I'll continue to track the collectors. When they make their next appearance, I'll notify you and your team. Be ready. Yeah, I decide who's on my Miranda team. And Jacob aren't enough? How many do you need to keep me in check? I've made it clear to Miranda and Jacob that you're in charge. You decide who joins your squad. Everyone else on this list was chosen specifically for this mission. They're the best. All right. I'll do the best I can with what you've given me. I'm sure you will. Before you go, two things. First, head to Omega and find Morden Solis. He's a brilliant Solarian scientist. Our intelligence suggests he may know how to counteract the Collector's paralyzing Seeker swarms. And secondly? Sounds good. What else? I found a pilot I think you might like. I hear he's one of the best. Someone you can trust. Someone hey, we Commander. know. Just like old times, huh? I can't believe it's you, Joker. Look who's talking. I saw you get spaced. Got lucky, with a lot of strings attached. How'd you get here? It all fell apart without you, Commander. Everything you stirred up, the Council just wanted it gone. The team was broken up, record sealed, and I was grounded. The Alliance took away the one thing that mattered to me. Hell yeah, I joined Cerberus. You really trust the elusive man? Well, I don't trust anyone who makes more than I do. But they aren't all bad. Saved your life, let me fly, and there's this. They only told me last night. Ooh, new ship. Cool. SR2. Well, we can work with that. <laughs> it's good to be home, huh, Commander? I guess we'll have to give her a name. Mission 2 done. Uh, sad I couldn't loot the Quarian building. I thought that was where I had to go, but seemingly it wasn't. Uh, heavy weapon ammo. You must recruit the head scientist to build this upgrade. Ah, plus ammo capacity. So, there's research stuff, so probably need the uh, credits for that. Well, I've played the game before, but I... It's been a couple of years, don't know all the details anymore. 
But yeah. We have a, a crew already. A couple of them. Welcome aboard the new Normandy, Commander. I've been looking over the dossiers. I'd strongly recommend starting by acquiring Morden Solus, the Solarian professor on Omega. We know the collectors use some type of advanced technology to immobilize their victims. We'll need him to develop a countermeasure to protect us. Well, without that countermeasure, we'll be helpless if we ever run into the collectors. Acquiring Professor Solus seems like the most logical place to start. Who are you? I am the Normandy's artificial intelligence. The crew like to refer to me as Edie. Uh, okay. Helmsmen aren't happy when someone takes control of a ship away from them. Especially Joker. I do not helm the ship. Mr. Moreau's talents will not go to waste. During combat, I operate the electronic warfare and cyber warfare suites. Beyond that, I cannot interface with the ship's systems. I observe and offer analysis and advice. Nothing more. Good. Uh, so... Well, I'm guessing it takes more than just the three of us plus Joker to fly this ship. The Normandy has a full crew. They're at their stations awaiting your orders. Final preparations for takeoff are complete, Commander. When you're ready to go, just pick a destination from the galaxy map and the CIC and I'll plot a course. Jacob and I should return to our posts. Come find us if you have any questions. Okay. There's the galaxy map. Then there's private terminals. Okay. Weapon lockers to choose weapons. Good. Then we have other decks. Also good. <laughs> Okay, personal cabin to customize the appearance. And tech lab, which probably won't work without a professor. And yeah, that's that uh, Sahid thing is, I think, a DLC, so you get a uh, different different uh, group member so the council go to the citadel and request a meeting with the council the professor ask what are you about Morden okay uh, what do we have to do for the collectors using okay assemble a team Warlord. Not sure if that's also a um, DLC thing. But there's a couple of people to recruit. And Omega. Uh, for the professor, we also need to go to Omega. Oh, not sure. Uh, but all of that and ship exploration next time. Thanks a lot for watching. Do hope you've enjoyed and do hope to see you next time. Nice day and bye.